I'm Francesco Clemente, an artist, a painter. I met Boetti in Rome. Uh, I moved to Rome from Naples, from the south, and Boetti moved to Rome from uh, Turin, from the north. Boetti was very fond of symmetry, and um, when we met, he made fun of me because he thought that uh, Going south meant to get away from order and ambition and power, and going north meant looking for ambition and order and power. And so we, our movements were symmetrical and complementary. We were very close um, for about 10 years, all through the 70s, and he was really a great friend and mentor. Um, he always had an interest in younger artists. I was 10 years younger than him, and he really opened the door for me. He made all these works with letters that were organized in a grid, and um, one of them uh, said, insicuro non curante, which means unsecure, carefree. And this was really a great autobiographical statement on his part, because that's really who he was. He was extremely unsecure, and at the same time, he had this carefree attitude, which came from this vivid intelligence, where he could always look at something in an original, unexpected way and this, this gave him a lightness and a brightness that, uh, that I was very fond of. Boetti uh, uh, had a lot of his work uh, crafted in Afghanistan. All the embroideries were made in Afghanistan and he actually, before I met him, he had an hotel in Kabul which was called the One Hotel and which was uh, notorious for the travelers at that time, because it was the only place where you could get a, a fruit salad without getting sick, because it was clean. I'm happy I saw Afghanistan in those years. I was not so fond, I was very fond of India, because India to me was a contemporary place, whereas Afghanistan was really like, uh, uh, to go to Afghanistan was, was like stepping in a, in a Beato Angelico painting. It had all the beauty of Beato Angelico, but also all the cruelty. And, uh, but for Alighiero, this was really home because he, he enjoyed the, not the cruelty, but the severity that went with the cruelty. I was very attracted by the fact that he had an interest in, in two levels of the making of art. One more esoteric, all these codes that he was designing that were not really understandable at first. And, and at the same time, he had an interest in a seductive aspect of the work to draw for himself these borders um, between order and, and chance, uh, meant to define a space where uh, really anything can happen. I don't think um, there was a full appreciation of what, how, how important this work was. Mm -hmm.